Karibu Tena. Thank you so much for sticking to Y254 TV. My name is Cheryl Blessing and you are watching the Power Talk Show. Before we went on our very short break, we were having a conversation with Bimix KE and Kruger Gush. We were talking about the future of the Kenyan creative industry particularly the music space. Tumongelea history when you may inform the present times and some of the things that we think we can do to make the, the, the industry better in terms of trends, platforms, and the structures that we set as artists, as producers, as consumers. Swali Tumekuliza on our socials is, what is your view on the future of the Kenyan, uh, Kenyan creative industry? What's your view on the Kenyan creative industry in general? What do you think about the future? What do you think about the present? What do you think we can do to make it better and more sustainable, Kwanzaa? That's the one thing we want to find out. So go on our platforms at Y254 and share your opinions, a comment, an experience that you have, and we will sample that as we progress with the conversation. So before to end it, to look at there's a way that song is a trend, but uneza sustain utter through the trend to translate this these numbers into funds oh and to make them people who will be loyal to your brand. Na kitu pia tumesema, before we talk a break, Bimix will sema something important. You have to have a catalog. You have to have something. You have to work, have a portfolio. Kitu enye, mtuwe kuzo kwa page yako, anona, aya, si song moza peke yake, ama mm. si kitu moza peke. Otherwise, uneza kwa one hit wonder. So, how do you ensure that? What if, mimi ni song ya kwanza ni drop na, ime blow up. How, how do I how do I maneuver that? How do I make sure that Bado ni true to myself and I still create art? Kruger, could you maybe give us an opinion on that? Uh, assuming ume, ume ulipo song jano karaoke ime blow up. Yeah. Um, if it was me, I think I'd spend the, the following days niki produce more of, of that content. Like yeah. More content ya kupushe and ime blow na more new music maybe ya ku back up ya ku build catalog mm. yeah and to make sure i stay relevant and consistent mm. so in some ways ni kama una build on that yeah. au jacha to your trend imeenda 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 ime die you see right do na ati mpaka mali tafika dead end mm. single jam and say na sasa na translate aje kwe do honestly before malizio point just to add um so it's it's advisable it's not the best thing ukiana mm. kutokea hivi when you're relatively new mm. na song i pop mm. i end and i blow because ina kwa changa situation nyingine you're standing on gas mm. na cheki you have a structure you just know the moment track him blow there's a lot of things in happening in that trend unapata so yeah, amesonga sure. nayo yeah. mm. kuna ile wasio amenda kukuangalia the starting looking into you but where we mentally bado hauko in a position to handle yeah, such that. Your, your, your status when you come na by the actually the best thing pole pole you know you through kutamak through the process mm -hmm. you actually grow you get better in a kwala unaweza ku manage na ku handle mm -hmm. your status it come mm -hmm. but in the in the event you say mate nimeenda ku track yangu ya kwanza ndio hiyo nimetoa mm -hmm. na ime hit mm -hmm. Um to a more like in the long term. term. In yeah. the long term, in yeah. the long term, we um to a very likely kupote. Mm. Very likely. Kusa so ni ngumu, kwa sababu unazo kuna, maybe ni kona luck. Maybe unazo mamangwa na umbaga yeah, ni luck kweli. usiku yote. <laughs> Amen, Will it be luck? the blood of Jesus. Will it be luck if you mm. hit once and then upote? Yeah. No, because I'm just thinking about a situation. You know, this day, it's very easy. I can be singing in my room. Maybe I'm just doing something, post it on my TikTok, and then people share it. Because sometimes you're not prepared for blowing up. And when you say, there are structures. Perhaps, woli woli watch video moza. Mtuwa kisema, ukitika video kwa blow up, eka hashtags. Post at this time. Taga wa watu. Alafu mimi ni bahatishe. Niseme wata unajua, nimeimba, wacha ni post, nione. And then niende. Una sustain aji sasa yu venye imenda. And how do you translate those numbers into money? Because I think that's the issue. People have social media numbers. People have followers. People have all these views. But how do you translate that into currency? Enye unasema, i song, i trend, imenimikia hii pesa engeneza produce hata hizi songs zingine ndo ini sustain kama artist yeah, it's more of kama kwa biz kuna 
a story of conversion like mm. you might post something up like a lot of impressions na a lot of inquiries but you you have very very limited conversions yeah so upon do not found capitalize more like o um same ame maybe an a vibe to this new song yenye ime pop sai nini anapenda kuyuhusu na what more can i do kwa my other upcoming songs mm. pia bado ipende like sb mix radio process ya fun funneling mm. ni important sana mm. eh. so ni kama bado hapa na so, apply business like, skills like ujue, you have to ujue, mm. once ume pop Uh, how ko me jua target audience yako ni gani na yeah. the fact that song yako ina ina skizo na kila mtu doesn't mean kila mtu ni target audience yako yeah uh, so hiyo ndio process so once ume pop una faurudi hapo so anza ku determine who's my target audience ni nani nataka kuimbia for the long run si yeah. sai tu mm. i think hapo pia ume bring up a very important point about finding your target audience because watu wengi wana wana posting tu for consumers but hawaja figure out unataka kutarget mm, nani, nani unataka eh, target. na kila song every every art iko na clientele every art has its consumer because sure. kuna mtu mwenye atasikiza a uh, resonate kabisa mtu mwingine asikiza kwa like mm, mi sijua hata huyu mtu anaongelea nini uh, you know good. Eh, like it's really Pass. nice but i can't relate <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you know so una figure out ataje hivyo uh, on that peer bmix maybe you need touch on peer you could translate those numbers into money and then how do you figure out your target audience how do you find tune ujue awa ndio huyu ndo mse mwenye naongelesha na indo audience yenye natafuta okay, no, no, especially coming up to the audience no weza kujua your audience which comes back to the process mm. you can't exactly know your audience with one project and yet may hit you need to have a, a number of projects umefanya ndo iko law first of all you as a ku identify your sound kila msanii yako na sound yake tofauti na uweze identify on the first go wanaweza piga track ya kwanza umepiga umebahatisha hii style imeingiana but unakaa chini after a while you realize that's not actually your sound yeah yule labda kwa studio msanii alikwambia sema hivyo na ukasema hivyo uko na haja but bila yeye kwa kwa studio haitokea the same so i'd say first of all you need to find your sound you find your sound in the process of finding your sound utapata watu wanaipenda mm, in the process wako. of dropping catalogs and uh, makazi ukidrop ya kwanza ya pili ya tatu promote it promote it as much as you can you unafanya you, you drop a track promote it as much as you can go to the next build up on that promote it as much as you can in the process of doing that after 1 2 3 4 5 10 releases to realize ngoja kuna hii age planning from 18 to 25 wananisikiza sana yeah. na kuna hii age from 25 to 35 pia naona wako hapo yeah. lakini from 18 kwenda chini hakuna mtu from maybe ha- that's how you get to know from mm. the metrics from the analytics lakini hizo analytics zinakuja from a compound of work azizi kam azizi kam na track moja mm. ile tuli hiyo hata analytics za on the platforms in case you don't know analytics ni the numbers yenye inakuonyesha how many views you have likes age group country even squeezing a specific at towns and different things which in a side on social media so you have to have released a few things ndio uone ukijujue hawa ndio watu wangu yeah. but sasa tuko kwa era enye kuna consumption ya mbio kuna songs nyingi kuna content Bana. nyingi nikiingia tu hivi kwa simu like new of course release. the new songs lakini like, hey. una realize by the way do you realize in as much as kuna content mingi mm. here even the watu wanasaulika very rahisi yeah. exactly you so don't i want to yeah i want to stick. talk about Mr. that because i was scroll. listening i was listening to some artist na hiyo song trust you me hiyo time nilikuwa nime replay nime replay nime replay do you know hiyo song nilipata tena hi month nikaenda kuipata youtube niko like oh my god kulikuwa na hii song at some point yenye nilikuwa obsessed over <laughs> na sai it's been less than maybe 2 3 years na nishasao aiko kwa playlist yangu totally new <laughs> yeah alafu unaweza tuko kwa era yenye kitambo watu walikuwa na download music so uko na playlist unaweza sema eh hey, niko na hii song niko na hii song enye unajua consistent because utaisikiza over and over again yeah squeeze it kwa apps 
tuko so, tuna stream unless we had a yeah. playlist ya yeah, favorite or something exactly outaskiza okay, itakuwa tu utapata tu new music hiyo ndio inapushiwa new music new, new content music. Yeah. how can you stay relevant in this day and time how can you stay relevant in e era yenye kuna fast consumption do you have a secret of how you do it uh, trying to have as much as new music as you can put out there yeah and at least waki waki highlight new Consistent. music mm. your name is there like you try to associate your name na the new stuff i'm not mm. talking about trading waves talking about being consistent mm. being try to be consistent being as much as basically as well. active ile design yenye watu wanakuona wanakuona mm. they see a hey, kruga bado namuona bado yeah. anafanya kazi mm. hata kama maybe you unaweza kuwa maybe saizo ufanye music or something but anakuwa na una, unafanya show mm. anakuwa na uko interview bado you're still active juu sai inataka ukwe consistently uko on top you need to things. be active basically yeah. basically you need to be very doing active. things mm. lazima uko na do things by the way unapata success mm. ipatange mse amefanya kitu na amekaa mm. inapata mse amefanya vitu na zinaendanga zikiendanga ashafanya ameenda anaenda kufanya nyingine yeah. in the process of anaenda kufanya nyingine anapata haja hii kumbe ilishaanza kupika eh hey, na sai bado uko na some more content coming so i, kuna hiyo aspect ya kujituma Lazima tu jitume. Lazima kila siku ukiamka una produce, una produce content. But now your production ina take do. Cuz we just talked about the expenses of production ya video, kulipata producer and, and record no, song. New music is expensive. New music is expensive. <laughs> Not even beats. Basically music is expensive. Imagine yeah. ulipo producer, mm. when ulipe ulipe videographer Ulipe, ulipe market location ulipe ulipe distribution owner oh, by the doing music it's, it's so expensive it's, it's, it's very expensive because now expensive. now that's what we're to, we're talking about because that's what we're competing we're competing with people who have budgets the millions of millions, dollars millions. By the, backed by labels and corporations alafu sasa nyinyi kama nyinyi ni artists mnaji represent hamna label hamna mtu mwenye ati mnaweza sema uko na sponsor na ni backup ni nyinyi mnategemea tu hiyo pesa ume make ndio inakushia kidogo nao fans by the way mm. una realize wale wase unaweza una, una, una msema come out of nowhere and release a track na all of a sudden ameanza imeanza ku trend imeanza ku pop mm. inakuanga huyu mse most cases unapatanga already ni mse akuna do akona structure but not in the music scene ile mm. design ajakuwa kufanya music maybe amekuwa kufanya vlogging mm. unapata akona mahali akona ka structure ya pesa najua amekuwa in that creative scene mm. anajua producer anaweza ongelesha amfanyie kazi safi amlipe anajua msia anaweza fanya hivyo amfanyie kazi safi mm. amlipe unapata kama hivyo unapata una kama Diana mm. kama Diana Diana vanyali kama ka pop up hakuja katoa track alafu all of a sudden ni kakwa hizo na 1 million akona 1 million <laughs> views na kumekuwa na artist in the first hawajai wanata hafa ana ana wacha hiyo una imagine Diana tu jini njua kama msanii all of a sudden na drop a track ni rapper na hiyo song ilikuwa video ni safi akona unapata msanii kama wewe mwenye ndo kitu kama ikuja ku trend lazima akona structure fulani ayuko tu ayuko tu ati ati But then what so you need to una you need a structure whether it's in the, the, the yeah you need a way to to get those resources to have a solid structure to support your art so ni ni steps siati ni one time siati una mko na mwamimi ni artist leo na na pop out by then ngumu una, una realize kuna kwa na so many artists mm. and, and then especially in the current age karibu kila mtu ni msanii unaweza rusha mahali upate wasanii watatu Jua sani ni wengi. Unaona sema hivi Nairobi upanguke wasadi wa sita. Watatu, mwatrap hivi. So ndo uweze ku stand out, you have to lazima uko umeji structure in a certain way yenye umekuwa kiput in the work, but resources ni very key. Bila resources za kukuinu kukushikilia kukua la uweze kufanya 1 2 3 ni tricky. Na kwa noma. Na sasa tebu wacha. Hey yo. Kupe ni pressure. I thought it was easy as having talent. Hey ni pressure man. Ni pressure. By the way, kupo point yenye talent pekee is not enough. It's not enough. Tebu kwa jeni kwa data tuche kwanza maoni ya watu because I think this is a very interesting conversation. I'm learning so much and I think the idea that It's easy to just make it and sustain success. It's not that easy based on our conversation. So I want to need sample some of the comments that you've shared. 
Swali Ndi, what is your view on the Kenyan creative industry? What do you think about the future where we are at, Penye Tunaenda? What is your view on uh, what's going on in the Kenyan creative industry? Iyondo nataka tuongele on our socials. We've been having this conversation. But I want to sample some of the comments of you guys because I think this is a very interesting conversation. So we have uh, from Facebook, I believe, this is Kizito Nyongesa Anasema watching live from Mwanda in Bungoma County, Asante Sana. We have Halko Mundi Anasema only government support is needed. That's a very important Halko thing. Mundi, Thank big, you big so much. Big shout out to Halko Mundi. He's a big, uh, he's a big videographer. Nice. We love yeah. that. Thank you so much for tuning in. Shiria B. Hilary K. He says persons in the industry keep pushing. I think that's also good advice. So we're trying to figure out where we can keep pushing. Thank you so much. Michieka Eno Kanasema, it needs to be supported, period. I think there's a lot of support no, no. that needs to be pumped in. No, I don't think it's only support, Pia. Yeah. yeah it's, it's from, like, everywhere. Kila mali, si gaba peke. Unazo kila tu gaba, but it's everywhere. Mm, yeah. Yeah, we have Balozi, David, Miendo Abesema, and a watch from Bungoma County, Asante. Vincent Ogutu Ako from Cabanas. Thank you so much for tuning in. So I think Kito Nye Tumeona, based on this, because uh, we are still waiting on some more uh, feedback from you guys. Support in Itajika. But vinyo mnasema, si support peke yake. People in the industry, tunafatu jitume. It, it's, it's something communal. Fans wanafawa kwe willing to put in the money, the assets. Government in a face idea. Na pia, tukiangale sector ya gava, kuna venye wamekuwa na try to support. We've seen different initiatives, kama Talanta Hela. They've launched that to try and help people in the creative industry. Wamekuwa unajua recently, I think since 2020, the creative industry mekuwa inachukulua V-series. Watu wamekuwa naona ni kama... Oh, how many platforms are going to make money? No, we no, can get revenue. No, 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 no. During the COVID era, it was the, like the only escape. Yeah. Uh, so mm. from then, we were all in the creative mm. industry, very serious. Like, People yo, have taken it serious. People have taken it serious. Nata wazazi. Nata wazazi. Nata wazazi. Una kumuka vinyo likuwa nasema kitambo, wazazi wako wanaona ni kama jobs za creative industry ni job. Sikuizu uneza muambia mine nda kwa fashion designer and your parent can actually support you because Very, they yeah. have seen millionaires, billionaires in the industry, people who are successful. So, what else can we do in terms of support? Gava ineza support ajitana. Kuzu unazo tunasema gava i support, gava i support. They have created some platforms. What else do we think the government can do to push the creative industry to a new level? Uh, I think... Uh to start for infrastructure, mm. like uh, by infrastructure, most of the people have career roads and all that stuff, which is good. Uh, we yeah. need good roads to end the show. We need, <laughs> we need stadiums to pick the show. We need community halls. Uh, like, mm. that's what I mean by infrastructure. Like, government of Ika program flani Gaval Kongana, Ia, CG, Studio Machinani. Studio Machinani. Actually, Studio Machinani is still there. The only infrastructure it's there, but it's not really, it's not really working. It's not out of the way. It's actually really genuinely helping. Mm. Una pata, kuna msa ya mekwa pale kwa studio yesa na lipo na Gavo, wende urecord. But hato kienda urecord, ya he just takes it and I could record chukua jipange. Mm. <laughs> but at the end of the day, it's not really helping. I love mm. the most actually studio machine is as it run. But what you can be actually a fun fact mm. studio machine because I'm aware it's a project under KDC and mm. there, there are still some projects that are there. The Ministry of ICT in collaboration with KBC has been doing that. So there are places where it's been working. In the past, there were some issues, but I think in the last year, kulikuwa na some review. Actually, the other day, kuna artists so mekuwa na record music videos and everything. So that's something people can consider. It's, it's, it's there, it's present. Maybe there were some issues that we need to review and do better on, but I think that's something in your one is a consider. Kwa sabu, I, mimi personally niliona watu waki record. I was actually impressed. Tunajua nilikuwa kwa makeup, napata tunapaka makeup na demo nya na record video. So two weekends. But I agree. Kuna platform zenye, maybe akuna yo support sana. Ama akuna yo follow up. Ya yeah, ina functionaji. Ama watu inyo kwa the personnel. Kuzi na zomtane za take advantage ya kipatu a position of power. Hmm. So maybe we can do better. But venye pia mnaungelea. 
kuproduce song tu peke yake tu kuproduce ni expensive tuko kwa era technology can't we use technology to help because now i know we have ai we have all these things you can even generate a beat using artificial intelligence a full song a yeah you can generate a full song because kuna time hata nilikuwa shocked tunaweza andika lyrics to customize and everything so how can we use technology to our advantage as artists how can we use it to cut maybe some costs kusema at least hapa ina nini jupi hata Nairobi county ime allow people can shoot videos within Nairobi for free so at least kuna hizo vitu zimesaidika kidogo but what else can we do to utilize what we have Unana, especially coming up with the, the ai and stuff mm -hmm. mm, especially in the future of the creative industry scene and in the music scene tumefika point yenye ai itatumika ku argument mm. the production process na in that regard na maanisha kuna fa kwa na structures zenye zinafaa kuwa zina regulate mm. real authentic work and yeah. uh, the ai stuff but the ai inafaa ku come in ku help ku kusabu unapata ai unaweza tumia ai ku separate different features of a track yenye ilikuwa ishatoka ulipoteza masters but you can actually separate the beats the vocals, yeah, the vocals and the and the ad libs and all that una za separate the bass the e different elements is not an ai still ai squeeze it tunatumia hivyo vinyo umesema ku make beats mm. kutumia una make kwa ku make videos that actually cover, peer, cover arts, cover arts mm. and all that stuff so in a, in a yeah. help it's, it's actually helping na um, the more an artist learns about the industry and keeps on being aware and alert and and incorporate technology the more tunaendelea mbele kwa sababu sasa hizi tunafika point yenyewe unapata kitambo tulikuwa tunasema tunauza ma CDs sasa hizi ikafika point ikakuwa sasa ni story na ku stream sasa story ya ku stream inafika itafika point by the unapata like especially in the in the whole world ki 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 ki, ki influence and brand wise itafika point wenye unapata ki ma TV stations are not the one that are talking mm -hmm. si wenye wanasema yeah. ni influencers ile influence yenye uko nayo ile influence yenye uko nayo inafanya wasi wana kama wana kusikiza mm -hmm. cheki yeah. ile influence me build inafanya wasi wana kama wanataka kusikiza eh sema ya kinkaka ni nini anasema dana dana ni nini ameimba mm. mwanda kuja kusikia ni nini dana ameimba kwa sababu kwa na influence gani kuna watu wanamjua Na industry kusoma You have to be a student of the game. You have yeah. to be a student always. of the game. And you have to be willing to learn. You have to always be willing to learn. Yeah. And remain a student mm. and unafaa kujua kusoma itawaisha. Mm. Hata wale maguru sasa hizi I think they're learning about AI. People are still learning all over again. Unajua in every industry mm. AI imekam so far sasa sisi wenyewe wenye tutasema tumegrow kwa digital era kuna vitu zinye zina to overtake to collect chenga pale sisi ma ai zimekam design nyingine tutafanya hivi kwa kitambo tunaambia kama paro uji instagram eh zeri mtoenda kwa uji ai na sasa how else can we use technology juu wenye tulikuwa tunaongelea if we can shoot videos na simu nini tunakata je pia cost cuz unaweza kuna artist wenye for real ana hiyo do ya kwanza kulipa videographer kulipa sijui vixen sijui kulipa location how else can we cut costs cuz kruger there's a video i think i saw you shot in town yeah 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 and it was so creative very well executed so uli, vitu gani zingine unaweza fanya ku cut costs on some things as bado unajaribu kuji build ah uh, hivyo venye tunasema you can unaweza include ai kwa vitu kama ku create vitu kama covers beats mm. eh unaweza tumia pia ku review contracts inaweza yeah. saidia like ai is all over mm. eh, so like unaweza pia tumia ai pia ku analyze information yenye we get kwa nini your social your streaming platforms mm. na ujue uta uta maximize the on that information to get more revenue yeah. that way back then to do that lazima ungeenda to a certain professional which it have cost this much so ai na kam kokolea sana ku cut cost mm. and thank god for technology honestly as much as yes mm. maybe una zote kitulika like na tukiwachi terminator as, as much as it's a blessing pain as a kwa demise iko na challenge iko na challenges zake yeah. but mm. then as much as ai unaweza tumia kuunda your videos and stuff 
the really good ones see free true the really good ones see free when i be doing to me is zingine zenye zikona water watermark and ukitumia something with the watermark as a brand bado na kill vibe trick so you have to find a balance i think one way you can actually reduce cost for production in as much as you you're working with what you have in hand niku niku plan mm. una unaweza kwa maybe you have una work you have a music video and you shoot but within that music video you can actually shoot three music videos mm. una check yeah. umeenda location kwa hii location tume shoot na hii scene lakini mm. hii scene of which haitangia kwa the video bado ni smart yeah. still we used logistics kukuja hapa maybe we do um, hire uba kubeba the camera guy and all that stuff yeah. but me logistics but let's say we shoot your video na we shoot clip ya hii for another video ama mm. maybe for content for content umetoka na yeah. content umetoka na mm. content mbili una check so mm. ni kwa smart ni kwa smart na maximize on what you have mm. you have to be strategic sure. Now let's appear I, I may realize from this conversation yeah. there's a deeper conversation that needs to be had the business of music because ni realize it's Bana. a business and there is so much in it because abu always equal to artist lazima ukwe entrepreneur <laughs> lazima ukwe producer lazima ukwe way, creative especially with the topic mm. i think mahali tunaelekea the future of the music industry in elekea mali ndo for you to actually make as an artist it be do structure as a business yeah be proper inakuwa ni kama we ni brand like a whole business properly mm. ndoweza kuji ndoweza kusimama as an artist yeah. so mbitafika mahali sasa hizi i think uh, other than just instagram kutafuta my fans on facebook and other stuff says guys are working towards creating an email list mm. a mailing list yeah. na ukiwa na a mailing list au na say at any time unaza reach to them uh, on fan yeah. mkono yako kwa mkono yako but pia ni wase with such numbers unaweza approach investors mm, unaweza approach unaweza approach wase wanaweza kuandaa kuingia into the into the ku invest in you but lazima ku una approach na nini a business proposal unafa ukwe na plan una you need to have plan. a structure approach na business proposal okay approach na business yeah. proposal no no na hey, we can invest in this mm. business proposal I love that. I really love business. that. I think that's that's a very uh, deep uh, story that I think we need to get into. You know if I could like a part two, but then, because ngoza to uh-huh. time in a lapse. So maybe you can tie what you want to say with your parting uh-huh. shot in under uh, maybe 45 seconds. Utamani. <laughs> I can try. Una to time squeeze this dream and anga wapi? But yeah. I can try. Okay. So one thing pia artists should know is that kuna music na kuna music business. Don't the ever confuse industry. those two. Mm. Not the music. You got three. Eh, three. So I confuse so I confuse the three of them. Mm. So if we make make music at least kuwa relevant, kuwa na knowledge ya what's going in the what's going on in the industry mm. and how how is the music business going here? Yeah. Let's not pata wapi sasa on social. So I'm Kruger Gush. You can find me on all social media platforms under the same name. Twitter pale, Instagram yeah. Facebook uh wapi kwingine TikTok mm. you can stream my music pia kwa Spotify Boomplay YouTube under the same name Kruger yeah. Bush Ah uh, Bmix under 30 seconds cutting short na tuna kupata wapi Ah uh, nasema nga Bmix Nation what a one ah uh, mimi mnaweza nipata everywhere Bmix KE official Yeah Ah uh, nasema on my cutting short all we do is try First things first just try. Kama uko pale msanii unaangalia pale usi usikwame. Start, go, keep going. Yeah. And on that note ni kwa na a mixtape ina kama na jita the X vibes mixtape us cosa kwarada. Asante sana. And I think that's that's wonderful. It's a beautiful place to stop at. Let me read one of the comments that we have also. This uh, is from Twitter I believe on X. Kwizi tunaita. And ni kijana ya Psycho amesema firstly Kenya needs to invest in uh, music locally. I think artists sh- also should be persistent in what they do every single day. I mean, 
consistency will surely pay example nyashinsky thank you that was very insightful because swalietu ilikwa what is your view on the kenyan in our creative industry we have uh, mwangi ngare who says watching the show live thank you the kenyan government to support such industries can push such guys far and become productive to many kenyans and the country as a whole Thank you. Then Kizito Nyongesa and Atwood from Wanda, Bungoma County. Asante sana. I think that's that's a wonderful place to end at. Uh, Kruger, you can mix up in a drop soon. Actually, I'm working on my debut album. Period. Yeah, so, so stay tuned. Watch out. Yeah, and I think that's lovely. Follow them on their platform. Support Kenyan music. These are amazing, amazing artists. Music sells in Abamba. So go on their socials. Follow them and tap into what they're doing. I think uh, the creative industry has so much potential. We just need some support, but we need to do our part. We can do more, be consistent, be creative, and use what you have. Use the tools you have at your disposal to make the best of it. I think that's it for us today. That was a wonderful conversation. A repeat of this will air tomorrow between 1 and 2 p.m. It's also going to be up on our YouTube platforms. And uh, next week to Tarudi, same time, same place, every Thursday between 7 and 8 p.m. with another amazing, amazing conversation. So stay tuned. Bado tukona content nyingi on Y254 that's so relevant to you. And I hope you have a lovely evening. Thanks to the entire team for making this a success. And thank you for staying tuned to Y254. Have a lovely evening and I'll catch you guys next time. Ciao. <laughs>